Hello everyone, this is the daily devotional video for January 9th, 2018, sorry, 2018. Our passage for today is in the book of Luke, chapter 15. We're reading verses 11 through 19. Jesus continued, There was a man who had two sons. The younger one said to his father, Father, Give me my share of the estate. So he divided his property between them. Not long after that, the younger son got together all he had, set off for a distant country, and there squandered his wealth in wild living. After he had spent everything, there was a severe famine in that whole country, and he began to be in need. So he went and hired himself out to a citizen of that country who sent him into his field to feed pigs. He longed to fill his stomach with the food the pigs were eating, but no one gave him anything. When he came to his senses, he said, How many of my father's hired men have food to spare? And here I am starving to death. I will set out and go back to my father and say to him, Father, I have sinned against heaven and against you. I am no longer worthy to be called your son. Make me like one of your hired men. The title for today's devotional is Becoming a Prodigal. The prodigal son's journey away from home began with a desire. Perhaps he wanted to leave behind some of the restrictions that come with living under a parent's roof. Or maybe he wanted more money to pursue life's pleasures with friends. Whatever the case, his desire gave birth to self-deceptive reasoning, which assumes there's no harm in what I'm doing. I deserve this. That thinking led to a decision to prematurely ask for his inheritance and to his departure, both from home and from what he'd been taught. A Christian who has turned away from God follows a path similar to the prodigals. It begins in our mind with a craving for something other than what we have. The longer we allow the idea to linger, the stronger our desire becomes. When we cling to a yearning that is outside of God's protective will, then we likewise deceive ourselves and find ways to justify what we want. We will base decisions on our faulty reasoning and move away from the Lord to fulfill our self-centered dreams. Like the wayward son, we may enjoy the pleasures of the world for a time, but ultimately, we will find ourselves without the essentials common to all mankind. Unconditional love, security, and a meaningful purpose for living. We have an enemy who seeks to divert us from the Heavenly Father's will to a mindset that places desires above God and flesh tendencies that prefer pleasure over obedience. To avoid self-deception, make scripture your basis for living, and adjust your thought life and choices accordingly. And it says, see Romans 12 too. That's a powerful devotional. Oh my goodness. It's so important that we make scripture our basis for living, and abide by God's word, and let God guide our decisions and our actions. I love you guys so much. Have a blessed day, and I hope to see you back here again tomorrow.